most famous physical therapist on the internet. Hi, folks. I'm Bob Shrub, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. And together we are the most famous physical therapist on the internet. In our opinion, of course, Bob. Today we're going to go over tool number four for people with back pain. When we say tool, we mean exercise, stretch, positioning, or maybe just a tip. Yeah, like positioning and posture. You know, that's a big right. thing. So we're going to talk about two exercises that I like to group together, Brad, because they're, most people can do them. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people can't do the other ones we we recommend, but most people can do this one. Right. These Even two. if you're if you're elderly, if you're very right. weak, if you have a real some issues that. Why don't we start issues? with the easiest one, the windshield wipers? Oh but, yes, named by you, right? Well, I don't know if I invented it, but I always use this term with patients because I I think you can relate to it. So. So you wake up in in the morning in bed and. You can jump right into this, Brad, right? Yep. You, you got to have the covers off your legs because they're going to pull your knees up like this, keep your feet together and your knees gently together. There's nothing real tight with this. And then simply keep your feet together and your knees and roll this way, but keep your shoulders glued to the bed, so to speak. And we get a little gentle rotation. Yeah, why don't you show the wrong way, Brad? Yep. Why don't you show the shoulders come up? Let's do this. So if, you, if you're going like yeah. this... We, we don't want that. We want this. And By you, doing it this way, he's actually getting some movement in the back mm -hmm. and the hips. Yep. And we're working the core muscles a little bit, too. Right. Uh, one thing that's really important is, you got a question, Bob? Yeah. Okay. And you're going to answer right now, Bed. Yeah. Uh, if it hurts, hurts. it's like, oh, right. man, that hurts my back. And then you go the other direction, and it's not so bad, which is pretty common. Right. Uh, do not go the direction that hurts or go that direction to the point of pain. Right. Like don't push into it. So, oh, no If you pain. go to like 8 o'clock, go to 8 o'clock. Uh, I don't know. Eight, that'd be six hours worth of stretching. 2 o'clock, maybe. How about that? Uh, he's talking about position. Yeah. Right? So this is, yeah. 12. 12. Or that's go to, 2. Yep. And then, but this way, if you can go that'd all the way old, over and it feels two. good. Yeah. And what you'll find typically is day to day, this one this direction will get a little farther, and eventually you can go both directions uh, comfortably. Now, you can do this throughout the day. You can do this five, six, seven times a day if you like. I, I think it's a great way to get some movement in the back, mm -hmm. get some blood flow going yeah. to it. Um, I'll show the next one, Brad, if you don't yeah. mind. You know, if you uh, feel comfortable, you can do it on the floor if you feel comfortable getting up and down. It works a little better on the floor. One thing you can't do it, though, is you can't do it on a couch. No, I would say not to. Because one side yeah. gets in the way. Next one is cat camel, Brad. Oh. And you have to be able to get up in the quadruped position. That means on your hands and your knees. This is the cat camel, Brad. I'm not sure why, because I don't know which one is the cat. Wait, well, the yoga camel. people always square but Basically, you're going to arch up like this while you're putting your head down. And then you're going to go this way. And this it is, is camel. No, no, I, this to me does not look like a camel. A camel has a hump. That's what I'm thinking. And I'll tell you, this is great for fascia too, Brad. Sure. Like the, the fascia in your back. But it's a really good way to get moving, and it's it's not that difficult to do, and you can work it more and more every day. Yeah, and, it, you know, initially, if it hurts to go way up or way down, you just go in a pain-free range, and as things improve, you start to get to that I feel my range. back loosening up right now, back. Yeah, absolutely. Brad. It's a wonderful way to get all those vertebra moving against each other and. Without weight. All right, days. that's it, Brad. Two yes. simple exercises. Two. We Two. said they'd be simple, and they are. Give them a, a look, see, and uh, see what you think. That. I would like to say, have a goal. Like they say in England, have a goal. Have a go at there it. There you go. <laughs> there you go. <laughs>